yeah, this, as I understand, is um, your first team in the Philippines. Tell me a little bit about them and tell me about the, uh, the dream. Yeah, so they were the pioneers. We, they were the first size that started in December 2013. Mm -hmm. And then the, they then recruited the team of 20. And this is for my accounting and financial planning practice. So right. um, obviously Ethel, who's still with us, and Jude, who's still with us. Um, Louis was in HR. We had finance and also one of the EAs for my general managers. So we used to be called my cloud people because it was meant to be for my own accounting and financial planning firm. So uh, it's, it's, I have to pinch myself off and walking into these offices because it's, it's not something I ever dreamed that we would build. This business was never meant to be what it is. It was always meant to be my back office for my, my own firm. For me, it's about how do we give our team a real environment with that human connection and you know the world's changed with remote and hybrid and things are evolved and they will continue to evolve over the years but it's an environment where people can come and connect it's a place where people can come and thrive and, and grow and build careers tell me a little bit about uh why telecon and what does it mean for the for the clients yeah. the whole focus around telecon is bringing the community together to make them better people and better business owners Doing it in the Philippines gets them away from work, gets them off their computers. People always comment, most conferences you go to, people are working. Right. At our events, there's no laptops out, there's no one on phones, they're just focused because we've, we just, we put the event together in a specific way. It's now become, you know, globally one of the best, I think, events for our industry. And I think it's the way that we put it together, but it, it's only about getting the community together um, and helping them to become better. You know, Telecon to me, I love our clients. Without our clients, we wouldn't have a business. Without our team members, we wouldn't have our business. Um, and Telecon's a great way to get the community together and have a bit of fun and, and learn a lot. This is um, my, my favourite set of, uh, of, uh, of images. Um, and it reminds me that the most important thing in any business is people. We have the best people. And I know we both feel really strongly about that. And we're so grateful uh, for the people that we have. Um, tell me what's on your mind when you, you see these images over the years. For me, what this really highlights is why we've been able to grow. You know, we are a professional. We're not a typical outsourcing or, or business processing of BPO. We are a professional services business. We help accounting firms globally and, and we want them to feel part of a community and, and all the sporting events and all the team building events. And I mean, Wellness Wednesdays where we used to, we give fruit away every week. All these photos of clients investing in their, going and seeing their team members, the training that they're doing. Um, yeah, I mean, it's cool watching all this. It's, it brings back many memories over 10 years of all the things that we've done. The unintended consequence of growing is the impact we make um, to our people and to the communities and to their families. and. That's the part that, to be honest, is the part that gets me most excited and drives me to continue doing what we do because I think it, we, what we can promise is we'll keep, we'll keep innovating, we'll keep, we'll keep driving and striving to be industry leading and to give them some of the best careers and to our amazing clients as well, you know, we'll continue to serve you and, and add value where we can and I think for me it just means more opportunity for everyone. I think we'll make a bigger impact in the communities we operate with some of the plans we've got as well and you know, I just honestly want to say thank you to both our team members and our clients because because of you, we've been able to create all these wonderful stories and images and, and videos and experiences. And I think that's the, the part for me is that, you know, without our team members, we don't have a business. Without our clients, we don't have a business. And without our wonderful, amazing support team supporting both of them, we don't have it. Like with all businesses, there's times where things are going really well, but there's also going to be those challenging times as well. That's one of them. Cal, we had two of three offices in Clark completely destroyed. This photo probably doesn't show the true damage that was that occurred with this. For, for clients to jump into outsourcing when it wasn't a thing, right. I mean, they were taking a leap of faith and it was...